Hi guys, this is Sarah from The Savvy Professor. And welcome to our video on how to endorse a check to someone else. Make sure you stick around till the end to learn the correct method to endorse a check to someone else. Plan before endorsing. You need to decide who to endorse your check to. It can be an individual or a company. Depositing a third-party check can be tricky, so it's vital to plan the transaction beforehand. Confirm if the recipient's bank accepts an endorsed check. You must confirm with a person or company if their bank will accept the check. Banks have varying requirements and rules for endorsing checks to someone else, and some entities don't offer these services due to the high risk of fraud associated with third-party checks. Endorse the check correctly to the recipient. How do you endorse a check to someone else correctly? Begin by turning the check over, and you'll find an area at the back of the check that says Endorse Check Here. You will sign your name in this area as it appears on the check. Then, you'll write Pay to the Order Of, followed by the recipient's name underneath. The teller will double-check the recipient's identification, so be sure to write their name as it appears on their ID. Hand over the check to the recipient. After signing the check over correctly to the recipient, it's time to hand it over to them. Due to increased fraud cases, it's a good idea to accompany the third party to the bank for proof of identification when the check gets deposited. It's important to understand that a third-party check presents a high risk of fraud, and a better practice is to cash the check yourself and write a new one from your account for the person. So, there you have it! You can follow these simple steps to endorse a check to someone else. Feel free to like, share, and comment on this video. Till next time!